Hello and welcome to Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith and this is your place for professional video production techniques. The subject of this reveal, an introduction to Adobe Audition. Now Adobe Audition is going to save your ass. I swear to God, it's going to save your ass for that time when you have the perfect take, but something goes wrong. A cell phone goes off or it's just too noisy and you get back to edit and you realize that sound has a problem. That's one of the great things that Audition can do is fix, restore sound. It's also mixing and mastering. It's a full mixer in there. Uh, everything you need. Let's go have a look. All right. So, I'm, I'm showing you the most intimidating part of the interface, and that is the multi-track mixer. We're going to get uh, simple in a second, but this is a full multi-track mixer. It also has a video interface that if you, if you press the tilt key, or just like other Adobe applications, if you maximize this panel, then you will uh, open that up full screen. You can also set the resolution, playback resolution of the video itself. Got a history panel inside here. All of your, your files show up on the left-hand side. And there's our good friend, Media Browser. Let's maximize this panel. It's exactly like working with uh, Premiere Pro in finding and bringing in our stuff. One important difference with Audition is if you put stuff in the project bin and you don't use it in multi-track, it won't be there the next time you open up the project. I know, you got to put it in a multi-track, but uh, I digress. There's also a full uh, effects section inside here and you can have an effect on a clip and or on a track and the effects are really quite extensive. Many of them are similar to the ones that you've already seen in Premiere Pro like our multiband compressor, dynamics processing, echo and delay, filter EQ. There's a few more in here like an FFT filter and a, some scientific filters. People actually use Adobe Audition for scientific work and forensics work. That's the level of quality that Audition brings to the table. There's some modulation, chorus, flanging, and this is the baby right here, noise reduction. This is what will really save you. And we'll get into that in a later um, reveal. There's some reverb in here, including a convolution reverb, some special uh, settings in here for distortion, and enhancing voice, stereo imagery, and time and pitch, where you can actually do some pitch correction. And if you happen to have VST3 or VST uh, audio uh, plugins or audio units on the Mac, they will actually show up inside here. And you've got markers and properties. There's even a metronome in here. There's no MIDI, but you could record in here just like a regular multi-track, multi-channel mixer. And it also connects to all of your hardware. So if, you, if you're just plugging in a USB, uh, a USB microphone, fine. But if you have a larger rack with multiple inputs, it's going to work with that too. And another great feature, if you go to the effects, there's something called match volume, which again will show in a later reveal. What match volume can do is just that, match the volume. You've got four or five different tracks of audio. Maybe these are dialogue tracks and you want them to all match the same level. No problem. That's what match audio can do. Um, over, we're in the multi-track uh, section in here, but there's also a waveform section. And this is more typical of what you'd, you'd normally think of as a wave file. But what's interesting, if we listen here... When I first I arrived, I was... You can hear a lot of hiss, a lot of noise, and it's difficult to see that in a waveform. That's why Adobe Audition has something called a spectral frequency display. And over here, you can see this noisy stuff that, in fact, is noise. I really and take... You can use that to remove the noise. You can understand what noise is. This is dialogue. That's noise. All right. You can also see things like a cell phone. And if I play this back, you'll easily see. Now we've got a duplicate display here where you can look at it a waveform or I could close that up. And really the way to look at a, a spectral frequency display is left to right is time, just like a timeline. From bottom to top is the frequency. I can grab a marquee tool and drag this down here and play just that. Well, is an energy drink company committed to... So you've got all this control. 
So because of that, you can actually listen to things like the cell phone ring. And, it and you can remove that out. And we'll show you how to do yeah. that later on in another reveal. So Adobe Audition is a great tool. Mixing, mastering, recording, works with your audio plugins and hardware but its restoration and fixing capability is unmatched in the industry. Fantastic stuff. All right, hopefully you found this informative. If you have, then please click on the subscribe button to video reveal. If you're not already an Adobe Creative Cloud user, then get on over to adobe.com and download your free 30-day trial. Till next time, I'm Colin Smith, and it's my job to get you looking your best.